Hey, I'm Pete Dare, the Crasher in Chief at Bureau Crash. If you're watching this video, then you volunteer to take time out of your busy schedule to help spread the word about Bureau Crash and about freedom at the Warp Tour this year. Thanks so much. It should be an excellent event. We created this video to share some insights with you so that your time is not wasted and so that we get the most out of each stop. To do this, I'll touch on three areas, logistics, tactics, and debriefing. Let me first recommend that prior to heading out to the show, you share your cell phone numbers with others volunteering at the same stop. You guys will want to decide where and when to meet. Some folks will choose to meet at the venue itself. Others will choose to meet at a central location and carpool together. Whatever you decide, keep in mind that thousands of others will be going to the same place that day, so you'll likely encounter some traffic. We'll ship a box of supplies to the primary contact person for each stop will then be responsible for bringing it to the concert. The box will contain a lot of contraband. Obviously, since you're familiar with Bureau Crash, you know that we have some awesome t-shirt designs. However, rather than send every shirt that we make, we thought it'd make more sense to send a few t-shirt designs that'll resonate the most with the folks at the Warp Tour. So in the box will be about a dozen shirts for each of three or four memes, a bunch of flyers, some buttons, and stickers as well as a large bureaucrash banner for you to hang at the table. Though we sell the shirts on our contraband site for $17.76, we thought we'd make the process easier for you by selling them for $15 at the Warp Tour. Similarly, we'll sell the buttons and stickers for $0.50 cents each. You may want to bring cash with you to help make change for the initial purchases, as well as sunscreen and a cooler with food and drinks, as you'll be out there for a while. The box will also include sign-up sheets and an inventory sheet. After the event is over, if you could update the inventory sheet, and mail it back to us with any unsold items. Being sure to keep a shirt for yourself and the others, as well as some buttons and stickers, that'd be great. Second, let's talk about tactics. Here I'll give you an idea about what to expect and what kind of questions you're likely to encounter. Though you may have been involved with Bureau Crash for years, it's likely that many of the folks that meet at the Warp Tour won't be familiar with us, and maybe even the ideas that we represent. So be sure to do us justice. I don't think this will be a problem, but I want to address it just in case. Even if someone has a visceral reaction to the ideas you're advocating, or if they're the biggest status you've ever met, don't take it personally and don't attack them. Instead, thank them for their thoughts and move on. Or, even better, seek common ground. Tell them that you're on the same page in terms of goals, wanting to create a peaceful, more prosperous, rights-respecting world, but that it sounds like you differ on tactics. Find a bridge issue, something that will gain you trust in their eyes. If they're against the war on drugs, rent-seeking corporations, and crackdowns on immigrants, Hype that up. Bring them on board. Encourage them to think for themselves. Ask them who has the right to make decisions about their own lives, themselves or someone else. Probably the most commonly asked question you'll get is, what is bureaucrash? So you want to have a quick, concise statement to answer that. Maybe something like, bureaucrash is ideas-based activism for freedom. A few folks may ask, who funds bureaucrash? Well, bureaucrash is funded entirely by private individuals and we've never been offered, nor would we ever accept, money from the state. Third, the debriefing. Though Bureaucrash has had a presence at the Warp Tour before, this year, for reasons already mentioned, we try to be a little bit more thorough in our presence. So, if you could let us know how the event went by emailing me at pete at bureaucrash.com or my colleague Zach at zachfix, that's x-a-q-f-i-x-x -X, at bureaucrash.com, that'd be excellent. This will help us to continue to improve this process so that next time around it goes even more smoothly for the folks involved and allows us all to be even greater multipliers for freedom.